A Henry County couple is on trial for murder, accused of abusing their two-year-old foster child, Lila. At this time, the medical examiner said the little girl had broken bones, injuries to her pancreas, and severe blood loss. Meanwhile, her foster parents claim that she choked on a chicken bone. During day two of the testimony, the biological mother of the little girl testified. Joe Hankey was in the courtroom today. He joins us from McDonough. Joe? Well, Cheryl, the mother, Tessa Daniel, uh, testified today, as you mentioned, and she came emotional at several points during her testimony and could be seen at times reaching for tissues to wipe away tears during her testimony when she was on the witness stand. She said, quote, uh, she thought uh, good they were good people when she described uh, Jennifer and Joseph Rosenbaum, and she thought they had good intentions at first for wanting to take in her daughters as foster children. The Rosenbaums took custody of Layla and her sister in 2015, July of 2015. 2015, Layla died four months later in November. The Rosenbaums have claimed Layla died after she choked on a piece of chicken, but the medical examiner ruled she died from abuse. In court, Layla's mother said she lost custody of her children in April of 2015 after she failed a drug test, but there were no allegations of physical abuse against Daniel. Daniel said she became concerned when the Rosenbaums began sending fewer photos of Layla than her other daughter, and some of the photos appeared to show Layla, in Daniel's opinion, with injuries and being malnourished. She also recalled a phone call with her oldest daughter. She, she was just frantic, and she was hysterical, really, um, talking about how much she missed her old people, talking about me and my mom, and... Um, She was talking about that she um, just wanted to see us. And Daniel says after that phone call, she started recording phone calls with her children and the Rosenbaums because usually her daughter on the phone would be very calm, and that call was a drastic change in her demeanor during phone calls. Prosecutors also show Daniel photos from July of 2015 when Layla went into foster care with the Rosenbaums, and then November of 2015, shortly before her death. She described those photos and the differences between them during her testimony. I'll have that coming up at 6, but right now we'll send it back to you in studio. All right, Joe, thank you.